Hey guys, thanks for tuning in today. I wanted to speak with you today about printing tracks in Studio One Three. Now I'm using Studio One Three Professional. So this is a technique where you can take multiple tracks and print them down to a separate audio track. Now Studio One does have the ability to transform it to audio track. So I could actually take this track and transform it to an audio track. Let's say that I wanted to have the kick and the bass printed to a separate track. I would need to do it this way. So what I'm going to do down here is go to, go to my tracks and buses. I'm going to mute everything that I don't want included in this mix. So all the guitars, all the vocals. Okay, and I could just do the buses, but we'll just do it all. If you listen to this, this is what we're going to be printing. Okay, so bass and drums. So here's what we're going to do. So I've got this set up so we could do a quick export because I don't want to spend a lot of time exporting. So we'll just... We'll just see an example of it, but I could I could set this to any range that I want. What I do is go to Song, Export Mix Down. Make sure my I'm set up to WAV file between Song, Start, and End Marker. And what I want to do is I want to select Import to Track. All right. Now, normally I would use real-time processing, but for in the interest of time, I'm going to do it uh, a little bit faster here. So now we're going to go through here in, an, in about 10 seconds or 7 seconds, we're basically going to have a mix down of the bass and the drums to their own track. And there they are, okay? Just make this a color that we can see. Just solo this. That's basically how you do it. If you want to just export one particular track, you could also use export stems and select whichever bus or track that you want to print to a separate audio track. You would also use import track to do that as well. Thanks for watching and I hope this information was helpful. Please don't hesitate to post questions in the comments below or email me at the address listed here. If you like what you saw, please take a second to click the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching and good luck with your home studio.